hello friends today in this tutorial i'll be showing you that how to download all images from a url inside your local pc using puppeteer library so we will be using some javascript here uh, this is a web scraping project so basically we will have a any url that you can provide here to puppeteer and it will automatically scrape and download all the images which are present on the web page so let me take the example of my website freemediatools.com so you will see this is a url so basically let me provide this url right here you will see that let me provide this url here and now in the left hand side you will see that it will scrape all the images it will download all the images here if i run this script here basically node index.js if i run this now it will see in the left hand side it has scraped all the images which is there here you can see that this one this one it has scraped all these images which are present here so what we can do is that we can simply open this inside headless mode we can do this as false so once again run this script so it will open this url and now it will analyze all the images which are present here and it will download all these images so you can see that it has downloaded all the images which are present so here you can replace any url here guys let's suppose i need to replace here this url so procodestore.com so basically all the images which are present here it will download this hopefully inside our machine so you give this url here procodestore.com and if you run this script now just node index.js it will open this and now you can see that guys it has scraped all these images which are present inside this web page so this is a power of this script here you will see that automatically it has analyzed all these images and now you can see that it has scraped all these images which are present here inside my pro code store website here so this has downloaded this image also this this also this 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 also so all these images it has downloaded it and you can do this for any sort of url that you have make sure that you have no copyright issues because uh, this is kind of a script automated script which will download all the images for you so basically you can see that let me show you one more time two people are watching the stream guys so we are seeing how to download all the images from a url in puppeteer automatically it will save all these images inside your local pc so let me delete these images and start from scratch so now you can see that guys once again if i run this once again if i change the url let's suppose a different url i take here let's suppose uh, medium.com and let's suppose we have a blog post here let me copy this so if i change this to medium.com you can change this to any website that you have medium.com any you just need to provide the url and then it will automatically analyze the images so what it is saying no such directory for some websites it will work for some it will not work so make sure that you have static images because if you don't have static images then it will not work as you can see this file name so for some websites it will work for some it will not so you can see that but majority 90% of the website it will this script will work i have written the script in the video description guys so if you want to get all this source code you can go to the video description link here i have written all the source code here 
three people are watching the stream so if you want to get all the source code you can go to the video description link here this is the blog post i have written this is my blog post here so after this live stream is over you can go to the video description link if you have any sort of doubt you can ask in the comment section regarding this project it is just scraping all the images from the given url here basically let me explain the code for you basically we are at the very top we are requiring the puppeteer library then we are requiring file system path module and inside async we are passing headless to false so if you pass it to true basically the window will not sh not be shown to you and now if i and once again say that procodestore.com and now you will see the window will not be shown to you it will simply if i run this node index.js it will automatically analyze the website and it will you can see automatically it is downloading all the images so these are the images it has downloaded it so after that we are just having the response back from the client so we are just checking that if the resource type is equal to image in that case we need to save this image from the buffer to our file system and we are using the file system built-in module in node.js and we are writing the file here like this and after that we are closing the browser and what we can do is that we can simply wait for some time also await page wait for selector we can say wait for timeout we can wait for let's suppose 10 seconds for the images to be taken place so now you can see that guys it is downloaded all these images that you see here so you can see that you can take any example here this is very simple logic which is taking place and downloading all these images to your local pc If I change this to let's suppose medium.com once again so that was a tutorial guys so if you want to get all the source code you can go to the video description link I have written all those source code in the video description and thanks very much for watching this video